Today we're going to focus on cropping. Cropping is taking a photograph and pinpointing an area of interest. Sometimes you might shoot an image a bit wide, like in this example of a lion at the Washington DC Zoo. The photo is just a little too wide. You're catching some of the side of the area where the lion is sitting. It's kind of sloppy. It falls off. There's only a little bit of it falling off and it's distracting. So what you want to do is focus on your subject which is the lion. So if you come in and crop this little piece out, it looks like the lion is sitting in an area probably a little more expansive than it actually is. Nobody will ever know the difference because you've cropped. Here's another example of cropping. This is a photo taken at roller derby practice where we have two of the players talking on the sideline. It's a pretty good shot. I like the way everybody is out of focus in the background, kind of waiting for the next thing to happen. So when I took this shot, there was I believe one other photographer and possibly a videographer running around so you tend to get into each other's way so in this particular shot a tripod was in frame uh, you can see it a bit more clearly if I zoom out see the tripod legs a bit of the photographer or videographer and a portion of their head so to me that's a little bit distracting takes away from what we're trying to do which is show two people talking about what's going on uh, during practice. So you just go in and, and crop it out. Here is another example of how cropping can improve a photo. This bride is in a very nice gazebo, but there's a little bit too much gazebo on this side of the photo, not as cropped as this side. To even it out just a little bit more and place the focus on the subject, I just use cropping once again, very simple. So you go from this view, you can see it bleeding off just a little bit here, whereas it's not over here to this view where it's a bit more even, not distracting, and she's center in the photograph. 